real-life superheroes don't fly around wearing masks and capes. They're just regular people who stepped up when the world needed them most. If you could get anything on a Wheel of Fortune, it'd probably be this guy. Preventing windscreen repairs? that put a dent in anyone's bank balance. When taking care of a whole bus full of people isn't already enough responsibility, this driver showed he was capable of stopping two types of vehicles. Yet more proof that bus drivers don't get thanked enough. When a police suspect proved too quick to catch, up stepped this civilian. He may not have made it as a pro track star, but his speed came in clutch when he outsprinted the target on the run. You may have the speed over the police, but escaping the flash is a losing race. When two wheels are on the loose, two legs are sometimes needed to stop a rolling disaster. Is anyone noticing a pattern here? When the nearest fire station is about 100 miles away, ingenious uses of initiative are required. And he had a boatload of it to prevent this fire turning into an explosion. They sell motorcycles, but he proved his knowledge of four-wheelers was just as good as two. And she proved that maybe she shouldn't be using either. You can skate from the law, but justice has its way of catching you. Taking the law into your own hands usually isn't a good idea, but when it's done this way, you'll have every cop's favor from now on. Extreme sports require extreme moments of heroism at times. And luckily for this climber, when the ice melted beneath him, his partner had a helping rope in hand. Got you. I so got you. Mr. Miyagi would tell you the same. Thinking smart is most important. And this teacher thought fast and reacted even quicker. It was at this moment a gym bro for life was made. In a room full of lifters, it was reflexes instead of strength that proved the difference. Good friends have each other's backs. Literally. Saves like that redefine what the most impressive skills really are. This Speedy Gonzales abandoned its owner and proceeded to give a million mini heart attacks in the middle of a busy intersection. But unlike most police chases, this one had a happy ending. Buses aren't known for their agility, but this driver managed to juke an oncoming car with the precision of a pro NFL player. Give this man a day off at least. Pulling a lopsided lorry back onto all four wheels seemed like an impossible task. But if people team together, no odds are too great. Bro fist! Nothing says community quite like checking up on your neighbors. But this wasn't a social call, or like a call to arm themselves with the nearest water outlet to douse them flames. And luckily a hose was within reach. But seriously, how does your porch catch fire? Gravity may fail you but true friends never will. And although for safety reasons I can't show you all the footage, don't worry, he got off without a scratch. <laughs> Next time someone underestimates you for your size, remember this. Even a tugboat can save a ferry from crashing. Bravery doesn't come in sizes. These two criminals got a taste of how it feels to be locked up midway through the robbery. After spotting the heist attempt through the shop window, a passerby are thought fast by closing the exits, and all that was left was to wait for the cops to close in on the trapped thieves. In this game of cops and robbers, horsepower met fork power, and the fleeing suspect didn't have a chance. Imagine trying to escape the squad when you've got five stars on GTA. He's the coach for a reason, and moments like that prove why. When the master saves the student from a nasty landing. And who said robots will bring humanity's doom? Some heroes come in circuits, not capes. And let's just hope he didn't take the blame for that mess, after the guilty party ditched the crime scene. No handbrake? No problem. Just as long as your truck rolls into the path of a random guy with super strength. He made an out-of-control truck look like a shopping trolley. And that's how you know you've got the perfect police partner. That right there is a cop who definitely aced all his physical tests and training. Turns out it's not just your foot that can get stuck on the track. And when this van's journey went off course and on rail, a super push was required to escape. When just being present within reality is enough to save a life, 
Remember guys, no Snapchat conversation, Instagram reel, or rare Pokemon is worth walking in front of traffic for. Mothers tell their kids to always look left and right before crossing the road. But that doesn't mean they listen. I guess that's what Spatial Awareness Level 100 looks like. Parents know they can trust their kids with her anytime. But this time, it was the bus driver who needed someone else to come to the rescue. There's just some things they can't teach you in school, and when needed most, this kid made the leap from Mario Kart to school bus savior. And all without breaking a sweat. That's what I call a smooth operator. This bystander may need a walking stick, but his legs were still good enough to take down an armed criminal. After putting his foot into the fray, he ensured the fleeing suspect took a trip straight to jail. Sometimes even the most innocent moments can take a turn, and usually it's mothers saving their children. But this time the roles were reversed, and this kid stepped up to save the day. All he needed was a ladder of opportunity to show the world he was super. Everyone knows a motorcyclist's best friend is his ride, and he turned on the burners to make sure his two-wheeled sidekick was safe and sound. If you need an example for the expression, he's not my enemy, he's my opponent, this would be it. In another life, these two definitely could have had a career in ballet, but preventing a heavy fall was good enough. We can't count on everyone to abide by the rules of the road, but we can do our best to play our part. Want to get yourself out of a grisly situation? Having a cycling buddy who can scare off predators is a big help. Imagine its surprise when it realized that cyclist was also fluent in bear. Inches, that which separates multiple repairs being needed, and just a very close call thanks to some serious determination. Having an eye for the authentic is a life skill we'd all benefit from. Like when this sharp-minded bystander spotted that the weapon of choice was faker than a movie prop. That fire extinguisher, however, was very real. If they make getting a race car out of a river look that easy, this group can win any tug-of-war competition you put them in. Not many people rotting in a jail cell can say the power of the church put them there. But after spotting the culprit's ladder, this nun's faith was put to the test, and prevailed when she foiled the heist of two masked sinners. Dogs aren't just a man's best friend, they're here to protect us too. This heroic hound made sure to help a damsel in distress and chase off the attackers. Her car got completely submerged in water, yet she managed to get to land all without getting her hair wet. Now that's impressive. When it came to a test of willpower, that masked villain didn't stand a chance. What a way to bar the door to crime! Helicopters and tidying up usually don't go in the same sentence, but in one big sweep, a full day's work was reduced to a minute. When hurtling toward eminent danger, some people just concede. Others perform crash-avoiding moves that prevent a very expensive collision. This guy's reactions are so fast, he could catch a bullet mid-air, challenge the speed of light, and make time itself feel like it's dragging behind. But all of that is nothing compared to saving his son from having a permanent imprint of a skate deck on his forehead. Your chances of getting out unscathed are greatly elevated when you have a rescue guy like that on the job. I'm not too sure what this guy was doing on top of the car in the first place, but I'm pretty sure moves like this are reserved for those who have the letter S stamped to their chest. Moments like these prove that there's no such thing as off-duty for some cops, whether you're on working hours or enjoying a late-night bite. When a car started slipping like Bambi on ice downhill, in stepped in the great preventer of car insurance headaches. After a catch like that, you could say her gymnastics career is in safe hands. Some detectives will go above and beyond to get their guy. Take him, for example. He left in the middle of an interview to tackle his perp to the ground like he was a linebacker from the Philadelphia Eagles. 
Speaking of things with wings, these bird watchers took their trip into the mud a bit too far. Luckily, this good Samaritan was willing to become a human stepping stone for them. I'm not even kidding. He actually lay down in front of them and let them step on his back in order to get out. Note to self, avoid waist-deep mud. And always keep an eye on your weapon, which is something this guy had to learn the hard way. Because if you don't, a hotel clerk may distract you and swipe your gun when you're not looking. Not to mention, make you check out way earlier than expected. One thing's for certain, life in law enforcement is rarely boring. This cop had the unusual task of chasing down a grandma on the loose, and the reckless joyrider needed to be escorted back home. Now, let me grab my map real quick. Just a second. Hold on. Are you stuck? Now you're stuck. I'm not gonna tip it. Okay. Some cars just aren't rainproof. But these people converted a soaked situation into a much better ride home for the guy who parked an open top in a storm. Sometimes being a hero is just as simple as stopping a blind man from getting crushed by a moving train. Simple yet effective. After stealing a woman's bike, this criminal thought he'd get home scot-free. But then he ran into a real-life cowboy that wasn't having any of it. He heard a woman screaming. Stop him, stop him, he stole my bike, he stole my bike. And I kind of look around, you know, and then all of a sudden this guy goes whizzing by me on a bicycle. And if that wasn't enough, he even tied him to a tree and waited for the cops to arrive. All right, somebody get this guy a sheriff's badge. I don't know what's more impressive, the honesty of this good Samaritan or the fact that they drove that far with their wallet balanced on the roof. Not every house is a home, and a train carriage definitely isn't. It was clear this homeless man's life had really gone off the rails after the fire department was needed to get him out of a train cart he was trapped in. Even in a tropical cyclone, these couriers were gonna deliver. Just with the extra shelter from a few buses, two wheels and four went shoulder to shoulder in solidarity against the howling wind. Accidental heroes are still heroes at the end of the day. And when doing his news update on a missing person, this reporter found the man in question on live TV, ending a 14-hour search. Teamwork was used to deal with a slam dunk gone wrong, when this guy's hoop dreams turned into a nightmare. Whether it's a cat in a tree or an idiot in a basketball hoop, the police services are here for any emergency. When stuck on a zip line above water, a real-life ninja stepped in to save him from a very wet landing. Saving his embarrassment was another task entirely, though. Who said piggybacks were only for children? This cop showed his respect for his elders by making sure he got to the other side. Thrill seekers got more than they bargained for when their roller coaster ride turned into a vertigo hell trip. Luckily for them, it wasn't long before a rescue team was on the case. I think we can all agree if there's one thing that needs to be protected, it's dogs. But this panicked pupper wasn't making this rescue mission easy at all. After forcing multiple people into a chase straight out of Tom and Jerry, he was finally captured. A good cop never ignores a gut feeling, and after sensing something was off, these police officers made sure to escort this school bus to safety. And that's how not to pick up girls. This Twitch streamer stepped in to stop a stalker in the act of harassing this girl. And not even that friendly smile, if you can even call it that, could conceal his guilt to everyone watching. Uh, yeah, yeah. Good to see you. Have a good night, man. See you. Where from? Australia. Australia. Wow. Yeah. Have a good night, man. Oh, small bear? Yes, yes, yes. Ah. Yeah, yeah. It's okay? Yeah, yeah, fine. <laughs> See you, man. Okay. Hi. Have a good night. Hi. No problem. If something's nicknamed the Mexican Death Train, it's a pretty clear sign of its general safety. The search for a better life for these people is often a perilous journey. But these women have been giving migrators meals since 1995 to give each person a fighting chance. Nature served as a reminder that it doesn't mess around when these cops try to clear the road. It's gonna be tough putting cuffs on that offender, though. 
Either by big or small acts, we can all be heroes sometimes. But you don't need to be Superman to do great things. Just like hitting that like and subscribe button. See ya!